Residents and holidaymakers on southern coast of province will make a tense waiting tonight to see if a wind change expected at 2 in morning will subjugate Kuligalite fever. For now, there is still an urgent warning for Kutagi, Baraga Bay, Mura, Bunga and Golan head areas. However, if this southern wind change comes, fire can be pushed to the north. Popular holiday point can be pushed to put Bermagui on a high alarm. NSWRFS said on Tuesday night, people who do not feel ready enough to defend their property in Bermagui should consider moving to a safer place like Biga or Naruma before the nightgown. The crew also has concerns about Wapago, which is also caused by a number of spots on a number of spots. In total, Collagolite fire has managed to burn for about 5,800 hectares since it started immediately after 12 o'clock on Tuesday. All other fires are currently sitting at the advice level, including Abernethy fire, which has left the Cessnock region on a high alert early on Tuesday. As for Sydney, the city can wait for 29 degree summits on Wednesday but some showers are expected to return a little in the afternoon. As strong winds continued throughout the state, a dangerous surf warning for Macquarie Hunter Sydney Illawarra Bateman Coast and Eden Coast were also released for Wednesday. Total fire bans are also available for larger hunters for the northern slopes and the northwest. And Wednesday, NSW Sound. Moderate flood and wind gusts with estimation high alarm of Riverina region in South State put. South in South. As registrations went on Tuesday, temperatures reached a 37.2 degree summit at Sydney Airport. While main air station observation Hill City reached 35.7 degrees to defeat maximum of 35.6 Sunday. Penrith. Gosford and Nowra were broken 35 degrees. All for our live Tuesday scope. Pay attention to the website on Wednesday for the latest forest fire news.